Water restrictions are in place for a Tooele County town right now, but not because of the drought. Heavy rains and floods destroyed the water supply in Stockton, and now town leaders are hoping that their backup generator actually holds. New specials Brittany Tate on this story for us tonight. Brittany, how long are these water restrictions going to last? Well, Mike, right now there is no end in sight. In fact, the road that leads to the main water system, it washed out. You can only access it via four wheelers and crews right now still have a two mile stretch of pipe that they need to clean out before these restrictions can lift. Soldier Creek uh, over flooded its banks and it took the town of Stockton's water supply with it. Although the town saw record flood waters last weekend, the last time this actually happened was 1982, 1984. Stockton's water system is gravity fed. It was severely damaged. It's full of rocks, mud, debris. Crews are cleaning up the massive mess. They've been up there all day trying to dig out, trying to assess that. But responders still have a mile and a half of pipe left to assess. And even trucks can't get up there. I need to update the uh, town council and the citizens of Stockton. The Stockton mayor and town council held an emergency meeting Wednesday night to talk about restrictions. We're operating on our backup well and the backup well is run by a generator. That's one of the reasons why we've put the town on water restrictions is just so we don't overrun the generator and uh, cause the generator to short out. That means no watering yards. We're only restricting the outside watering, the showering, cooking, things like that is perfectly fine. And town leaders stressed the importance of conserving culinary water. Uh, if we lose our, our generator, we lose our secondary water system, and then we're going to be in some trouble. And they're already in a lot of muddy water out here in Tooele County. Right now, they are saying no irrigation water at all. The exception to that, the one exception, is if you need to water your animals. Now, they tell me there in Stockton that it would be absolutely catastrophic if indeed this generator burns out. They're crossing their fingers that these water restrictions do what they are supposed to do and that people follow suit. Mike, it's been 40 years since this creek washed out. And even at that, historians tell me that it was never this severe. Back to you. Yeah, it's incredible the aftermath of all that rain and all the flooding that's gone on. Brittany, thank you.